What's up guys? It's a pretty chilly day in Canada land, but I want to stay consistent. So, we got a pull workout for you guys coming up. Check it out. Alright guys, what's up? Welcome to pull day. If you guys haven't seen my push day workout, I'm going to leave a link on the video here. Uh, so you guys can go back and check in my, uh, my in-depth warm-up for my shoulders and my elbows. I, I like to do that before every workout, but I didn't want to include it in this one just to keep it short. So we started off with some bent over rows. I did uh, just the bar to begin with, and then I moved into my working sets here. Really trying to get that squeeze and not focus on uh, jerking the weight because it's all about using the back, not momentum. Next, move on to a lat pull-down here, just with the uh, regular lat pull-down bar. Focus on really just squeezing those lats at the bottom and getting a good stretch at the top. Next thing I moved on to a, uh, it's a lat pull down with the seated row bar. When I do it this way I feel like a much better kind of stretch in the, the middle of my back as well as my traps here. Check out the other angle here. Uh, a little bit of rounding in my back, that's okay just because I want to I feel like I can engage my lats more when I sort of have a rounded back. Next thing we moved on to was uh, some prone um, bench rows. I like to do these here, support yourself on the ground and then just sort of squeeze, bring those weights back. Try not to support yourself too much on the actual bench, but touch the floor and go. Move on to our bicep workout now. So we just started off basically easy curl bar. Just eight to 10 reps, you know, two or three sets. Get the, the elbows warmed up as well as uh, biceps, you know, start to get them on fire. All right, next we moved on to a, a prone seated uh, hammer curl here. I learned this one from Olympus Iron. He does this in his videos, and I thought I wanted to give it a try. Uh, the way you're sort of angled, you know, leaning back, you really kind of put all the emphasis on your biceps and it's, it's actually just even hard doing one side of these. It really burns, so try it out guys. All right, then we moved into some pinwheel curls here. Shout out to Nick Wright for, you know, showing these ones. I really like this one as it sort of, it's a different feeling uh, than just a regular curl. I feel it more in the center of my bicep and uh, it just adds a lot of depth to your workouts so you're not doing the same kind of curls all the time because biceps can get boring after a while, you know, even though you want guns, it's kind of boring. And then finally, last uh, movement, just for, for basic health, as well as uh, completion of your physique here, got some, some face pulls, just because a lot of people, they, you know, they lack rear delts, as well as they lack shoulder stability. So if you work on your rear delts, you're gonna, you know, it's gonna make your shoulder a lot stronger, as well as kind of giving you that cap look, which a lot of people lack and look for when they're doing uh, shoulder workouts. Just got back done from the gym with my pull day. If you guys like the video, maybe like the series, uh, go ahead, press the like button. Give me a comment, maybe subscribe, and uh, new videos coming up soon. Got a leg workout, and uh, that's all for now, guys. See ya.